All right. Hey, everybody. Hey, Ricardo. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I know I'm two away on YouTube and I'm point, I think I'm point eight away on Twitch. 
or um, the requirements at 50 followers and everything to have Twitch affiliation, you know, to get like a dollar a month or something. I don't know. So we're very close to both. We're very close to both. I sent you the photo of what I'm going to give away when we get to 100 on uh, YouTube. Hey, Thomas. So yeah, we're going to continue with Pokemon. Uh, I'm only going to be streaming three days this week because uh, Friday morning I had about two hour, two, two and a half hours east of where I go or where I live, go where I live uh, to do a bike ride, a hundred K bike ride. So we only do it once a year. We get together as a hockey team and go out there and do the ride. So it should be pretty fun. I don't know if Knox will stay in. Knox has been having some really bad anxiety lately. I don't know why, but he's had a lot of bad anxiety lately. So we've got to get a hold of What? Seven bucks. Wow. Did you see the thing I posted over on Rockets? Um, general page. Noxbox, come here, buddy. All right, but let's go ahead and get into it. Let's go ahead and get into it. I just gave him catnip. There's usually catnip up in his bed for him, but I, I don't know if it's from the really bad storms we've had in the area or whatnot, but he is not having it right now when it comes to um, sitting in here and wanting to chill out anymore. I don't, I don't know what's going on. He's right next to my right head. He, right. So my head is literally like right here on camera. I'm like right underneath it. And he's sitting right next to me. Hey buddy. Hey, can I put you up in your spot? Like he's purring and happy and wants attention, but he also like freaks out. Hold on, let me see if I can get him up there. Come here, buddy. Come here. Whoa, big guy. You can go, buddy. Come here. All right, hold on. Short delay before we get started here. Come here. Hey. Come here. Yeah, come here, buddy. Yeah, see, he's super lovey and everything. He's just, for some reason, like... Spastic? <laughs> I don't know what's going on with him. Up, but it's just you and me we do this all the time like i don't get it like he'll sit in here when i'm video editing and doing everything else but lately he's just like hell no i don't think i have my pokemon community game is working today i don't know why i don't know if my twitch is my twitch chat working if you're on twitch and watching me could you send like a just thumbs up or something so i know if it's working because i swear to god i can't get either twitch chat to work one day or i can't get youtube chat to work one day all right so we were Oh, we beat Marnie. We beat Marnie was the next thing. That's what we did. So now we got to fight Piers. And Thomas, I think you told me I can't. This is like a non-Dynamax gym or something. Like I can't go gigantism. Okay. Okay. Dark is weak to... Dark's a weird one. What's up, right? I know that his thing is the dude that looks like Gene Simmons, the Obstagoon or whatever. I know that's his, uh, his ace. At least I think it's his ace. At least that's what's always on all his cards. Hold on, mate. If you're gonna take on the gym mission, you better change into your uniform trip here in the middle of the alley. Look at the gentleman here straight ahead. I don't think anybody wants me to do try to do a cottony accent because it will be god awful. Uh what level are we? Uh I think we're a good level. Dark's weak to poison? Where is that? That sounds right. Usually I can just you know, muscle stuff over, so... Okay, no, I just saw that the Pokemon community game is working. Weird, that was weird. Gym Challenger. You want to get past me, but I don't want that. Basically, it's better between our desires. Next time on Pokemon. Kick this dude in the face. Alright. At a early noon. I do like the Galarian versions of this. Oh, shoot. I don't think I wanted to. Wow, 42. Well, he only has one. So, yeah, rollout, leaf blade, nothing super effective. Let's see. Oh, 
Holy crap! What was that counter? I was looking away. What was that counter? Okay, hold on. I have one screen that's on a slight delay. Let me see. What did he just use? Yeah, he used counter. I was like, what did he just freaking kill me with? Okay, I'll check it out here in a minute. Where did... Oh, crap. Okay, I was like, did I bring my phone in here? Oh, they're weak to fight. Okay. Well, that's because Lanoon is normal, I guess. It's normal dark. Which should mean Opsagoon should be weak to fighting, too. So that takes care of my concern there. Because Cinderance and Switched can both do fighting damage. I always feel like the gym, like, lead up, like, these fights here, they should have more than one Pokemon. They should have a minimum, too, I think. I know I'm doing, I'm going to fight back to back here. I get that, I get that, but I always feel like they should have two Pokemon. Um, who's, uh, Flygon's leading, I don't care, Flygon. Actually, I'm kind of curious. That's the one thing I really like about, um... Scarlet and Violet. I think they actually added it in a patch with the Blueberry Academy one that um, you can do like you can see what move they can learn by just looking at like um, going into their move set and it's like learned by TM and you can filter it down. I like the setup in Scarlet. I think the menu system's better than this. This is still kind of their old uh, like Game Boy style Setup, which isn't bad. I just think that they can take things from both this game and from um, Arceus and Scarlet and Violet, and just make just take the good parts of that, and you can make just an absolutely dumb game if done right. Flygon can't learn Jack that I have right now. Jack beat up. Beat up's dark. Eh, I guess that makes sense. Magic. Interesting. Hatterene can learn that, but Shift Tree can't. Okay. Uh, that's a special attack. Zen Headbutt. Oh. Oh. Really? A physical psychic attack on Cinderance? What do I have on him right now? Because that's that gives variety to Cinderance. Uh, let's just get rid of normal headbutt. Go with the Zen of headbutts. Endurance can use that giant brain of a forehead. Personal attract. Swing. Hi, buddy. Like, can you learn brutal swing? But that's really not going to help me in this. Phantom, don't care. Uh, charm, steel, steel wing. Hmm. Yeah. Hi, buddy. You want to sit here? Here, hold on. Let me get my blanket on my lap. Maybe he'll sit with me if I put the blanket down. Come here. Come here, my small creature. Come on. Your only opportunity if you're going to get up here, buddy. I want to drink my coffee. Oh, God, it's Mr. Bye. I guess I have to try and fight these two idiots. All right, fine. I'll just scoop you. If I scoop you, will you sit down? Popo, oh, it's okay, big guy. Yeah, you're sitting here with me. You're chilling. Uh huh. All right. Sorry. Cat distraction right now. I'm trying to deal with him. Make sure he's okay. Evil. Where's this fly gone? Do these goggles look like the goggles of mercy? Um. My Dragon Claw. There you go. Hey, sit down, big guy. The Goggle of Death. Of course, you're going to hit me all five times, aren't you? No, oh, only four. Okay. If I would have used that move, I would have hit twice. We all know it. Oh, I love Flygon. It was, um... As soon as they released the uh, Blueberry Academy DLC, I ran out and caught a shiny. 
rampage so I could get a shiny flag on. Like, within like an hour, I had gone out, did my sandwich trick, and shiny hunted the flag on. Or the trampage. Like, instantly. I was like, no, we're, we're getting the best girl, because I did get a girl one, so I got a girl flag on that time. Mr. Mime's like, oh, peace. Maurice, you weird Pokemon. Okay, I like the little, I like the little neon ad there. That's a nice touch. They're gonna jump out. Okay. That was weird. Yeah, watch two fat man do a flip. That's exactly what it's gonna look like. That surprise. <clears throat> Whoa! I tried to talk there by throat completely. Woo! Okay, coffee time. Yeah, it's only like 7.10 and I'm having my cup of coffee for the evening. I usually have it at like 5. But I found out if I just sit here until I pass out at my chair, I'll eventually wake up and go to bed. Um, He's going to use Sucker Punch. 100% he's going to... Hey, 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 Dom! Stay back. That's going to hurt. Well, it did kill me. Oh, that's fine. Is Scott doing his um, organizing? That I knew he was said he was gonna try and do um, his bulk organization. That's double shock. That's funny. Yeah. So at a hundred, a hundred followers. I'm going to give away a Pikachu V10. One of the older things I have. Now, I don't have anything vintage like Scott. I still have a couple, like, basic vintage cards. But I, I sold all my vintage stuff with my buddy so we could start the channel and start the... the Pokemon card business, side business. It is. So monthly giveaway right now is the Iono Tournament box. The 100 giveaway is that Pikachu V10, which I know has... Oh crap, it has a... Is it Fates Collide? Yeah, it's Fates Collide in it. It's got Fates Collide, Sun and Moon Base, Sword and Shield Base. And then Two Darkness Ablaze, I believe. It's a really weird, like, pack collection in that thing. I should have probably changed. I actually have a five. I know I'm oh, that's going to kill me. I should have changed. Um, Again, I'm not doing a Nuzlocke. We'll do a Nuzlocke playthrough after I beat this for the first time. Um, But uh, I know I'm aiming high here at 500 subs and giving away like a 151 set. It'll be um, an ETB, a UPC, a booster bundle, a Zapdos box, and a Alakazam box at 500 followers on YouTube. I think that's a pretty generous thing I could give out at 500 followers. <laughs> I will also say for my one year on YouTube, which comes up in June. Oh, you got the mail. That's fine. Good. It's a fun little box. The promo in that thing is awesome. Um, but at my one year event, I'm going to do a hundred packs. And for each hit I get, I'm going to give away a pack of 151. Oh, that dude looks weird because he doesn't have his makeup on. He does look weird. Oh, cool. I appreciate it. 
Yeah, the promo in that, I wish the one I had opened would have gotten uh, a little better centering, but it really didn't have good centering at all. Uh, Earth and Power? I don't think, yeah. It's not going to do much to him, so... Change it up a little bit using a Drapion. So... That's something different, at least. Ruddy chop. Actually, I gotta check my 151 stock. I think I have enough. I probably have a couple hundred packs still, so... I need to make sure I have enough to do that. So, 100 packs of... Mixed of Crown Zenith, Silver Tempest... Uh... What were the four sets I picked? Crown Zenith, Silver Tempest, Fusion Strike, and... Lost Origin. Yeah, that's going to be my one-year event. And each hit I get in that opening, I'm going to give away a um, pack of 151. Whoever's watching. I'm going to do that one live on YouTube. Only on YouTube. That'll be a YouTube thing, because it's a one-year on YouTube kind of thing. See, he just goes and winds at the door now. You can see him on the camera up there. I don't know what's gotten into him lately. Bobo! Hey. Alright, after we're done with this gem, I'll, I'll let him out. Sad that it's taken me almost a year to get 100 subs, though. <laughs> I've been doing Twitch for... I think only about... Six months, and I'm already at, I think, 60 followers on Twitch. I've removed all the bots. Is my team, like, all dead? Like, I'm, I'm not even paying attention to my team right now. I'm just talking to you. <laughs> I'm not even paying attention. Is my team dead? Am I good? Can I beat this? Uh, hell. Revive? Sure. Shift tree, get off the ground. Although I'm probably gonna replace shift tree soon. Not fun. All right, I need to order some fell away for him too. I think that'll help. Get him some kitty Prozac. I don't know why he's so stressed in here anymore. Like his food's in here, his bed's in here. He just seems stressed, and all he wants to do is go bother his. Fetch a gulb. Um, all he wants to do is go bother the other cats right now. Don't forget, if you see my um, model have a seizure, it's probably just me taking a sip of coffee. No, he's a boy, and he's fixed. This happened ever since we had the storms. Okay, so he's going to have, I can already tell just by looking at that little screen there, he's going to have a Toxtricity, which makes sense too. So I'm going to guess he's going to have a Sableye. Tony or... Oh, Damon. Okay. So I bet he has a Sableye, a Toxtricity, the Obstagoon, and... What the hell? Maybe a chat hot is weird as that sounds. See, this is where voice acting would have helped Game Freak. Like, cause it, it's just like people murmuring in the background and there's like nothing going on. See, I'm I'm really not a great gym leader. I figured that was a Nobody was coming to challenge me. No, your jackass of a crew put a shutter down and nobody can get into the city. Okay, there you go. Oh, sweeping. Dude looks like he could have been in the cure in the 80s. Can't even Dynamax our Pokemon. But well, I still hope you enjoy the battle.
He's he's usually like a super like he's not a scaredy cat. It's the weirdest thing. Like he's super sociable and wants to go outside and like go on a leash and get in the backpack and everything, but Oh my god, I don't know if I could do a full hundred packs on Golem's voice. Holy crap, that would kill me. Trixie with her hobbitses. Smeagol. Smeagol. I don't think I don't think I could keep that voice up the whole time. It would it's such a strain to push like I have to push my tongue down to the back like of my vocal cord area, like back towards the back of my throat. So I can get the higher pitch, but also keep like a girdle kind of sound to it. Sucker punch? Oh, sorry, with fake out. Then he'll do sucker punch, I bet. Let's see. Oh no, I'm really surprised. Fake out to a sucker punch would be super obnoxious. I'm dead anyways. Shift tree, you're cut after this. We're replacing you. You can go capture an Eevee and get an Umbreon. But, oddly enough, Umbreon is not my favorite evolution. I like the one that looks over-caffeinated, and that would be Jolteon. It's still my favorite Pokemon for the evolutions. Now, if they release a Ghost-type and quit being lazy... Oh, I forgot how... Freaking slow, Katarina is. My wife's favorite is Leafeon's. Which... I recorded an episode and pulled a certain Leafeon. But that video won't be out until... I think May 1st. I've been recording ahead of time a lot right now. Um, when I have time, so I also have time to sit there and video edit it and stuff like that. Alright, that hurt. How's Dazzling Gleam do against this guy? It hurts back. He's a <laughs> I call him lovingly the Cokehead Evolution. Oh god, I hate stall tactics with AI. I don't mind stall tactics in PvP because I know it's coming. I have pulled that Espeon and pulled it as a PSA 10. But no, this Leafeon is a different Leafeon. Actually, my favorite Leafeon. I will tell you, it's not the Leafeon from... Evolving Skies. I actually think that Leafeon looks stupid. <laughs> I have a... Well, I don't think... What is I have a stall deck? I have a stall PvP team with a, an absolute... Oh, he has a Malamar. I didn't even think about Malamar. Oh, I'm so dead. Malamar is way faster than me. Yeah. Fusion, so I picked Fusion Strike as part of the 100 pack opening because. Oh, uh, who should I use? Um, because when I first kind of got back into Pokemon, my buddy and I, we bought a Fusion Strike booster box that we found for like 100 bucks and opened it. And. Um, well, why did I use Zen Head Buddies Dark? I'm stupid. Um. Let's try this. And, uh... I don't have anything on the TCG Live. That's why I give away all my code cards. I'm dead. Alamar's a pecker of a Pokemon. Sir Fetch, get in there.
It's fine. I'm faster. That's all I care about. Kill this Malamar. Because I know then now... Well, I don't know. I was kind of expecting a Toxtricity, so I don't know what he... I imagine he's got a Toxtricity. No, he doesn't even have a Toxtricity. I was completely wrong about his team. Okay. He's going to send out... Dunk Tank. Which, that makes sense. Mm, I should be faster. He's going to use Sucker Punch. So... Because he just kind of told me he's going to use Sucker Punch, so... I'm just ID then. Can I take one hit? Mm, with Snarl? Probably, yeah. But speed. But attack, I don't care. No, I need to get my phone. It's sitting on the other side of my camera is the problem. Oh god, I'm trying to reach it. I'm trying to reach it without like throwing my back out. Is that everybody? Did I win that? Am I done? Okay. Down goes Piers. Even a bunch of promos saved up. <laughs> but did you get anything from it is the question. No, Piers has got money at least. He gave me 7k. I might use my monthly promo, and I think I have another $5 promo right now from picking up Unicorn Overlord the other month. And maybe pick up another Iono tournament collection to keep sealed. It said that there was a promo, so it said, what is it, $1 promo? What was it? The promo stuff, so you have like the promos, $10, $5, $1... I like I like the discount of thirty cents. Let's talk about the promo for the um being a uh Oh my god, what is their thing? The uh freaking My brain is so smooth already, I can't believe it. For being a GameStop member, basically. Watching your battle, bro. How I learned to battle and all that. Yeah, I might pick up another one of those. I might actually try to pick up like four more of those. I want to do a Got Milk episode. Um, but I don't want to pay the price for a Marnie carton. <laughs> be honest I have a couple Claras and Iris is still sitting around I've got god I think I have like four or five Professor Juniper still sitting in the closet and now that we have the Iona one but I'm like I really really don't want it. I think Marnie's up to like $85 right now Hey, there's some trouble over on Route 9. It's so bad, even the champions come to sort things out. Thanks, Leon. That kills people, Leon. On Route 9? Didn't we come from Route 9? Oh yeah, we panicked while we were going through the water the other day. Kaboom. Second, thanks for coming, but I've got it handled on this. Whatever's making that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep an, your eye on the goal. 
And for you, that's winning the gym challenge. The only gym badge left is the one you'll get from Dragon Gym Trainer Ryan, right? Ryan is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. He's that good. Clara, like, uh, I have the Clara... So, like I said, I was, I was thinking about doing an episode about, like, the milk curtains. So, like, got milk. So, Clara has her tournament collection, Cyrus's tournament collection. I was thinking about opening those with Iono's. And I have a couple Professor Junipers um, on hand. But I don't want to pay the price to open a Marnie carton. Because I think I could even look. What's it on right now? Uh, Marnie Tournament Collection. What's Marnie sitting at right now? For an unop? Mm. What's TCG have it at right now? Would be a better question. Okay, there we go. What does TCG have Marnie's carton at right now? 70 bucks. And I don't know if I really want to open up Marnie's carton for 70 bucks. Clara's part of the DLC from this, though, isn't she? Like, she's not a character, right? Because I feel like I remember seeing her cards, but her cards don't show up till late, so I'd have to imagine she's a DLC person. I didn't play this game, so I'm still still got to fly and blind a little bit. Do I have a like ice Pokemon to fight dragons with? Because if not, I'll go catch one real quick. Mm. Sure as hell don't. Oh my god. Okay. Let's go find an ice type to get rid of shift tree. I'm going to shift him out of our team. Uh, those are the jokes on a Tuesday. Sorry. Okay. He came from down here, right? Oh, Jesus. I ran right into Bergevine. <laughs> I don't like him because I don't like Avalug that much. Although the Avalug fight in... Arceus was a lot of fun. In fact, I might go back and play that. I, that is such a close, close second between my favorite game ever, which is Sapphire. Oh yeah, we didn't fight any of these trainers. We were going to come back and fight all these trainers, too. Look, Clobopus. We didn't really go through here because I was terrified and very tired on Saturday. Slide. Not a bad move, actually. Oh god, oh god! No clubopus. Bad clubopus. Oh my god. Why are there like no ice types out here? Get off the get off your stupid bike. Alright, 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 here we go. Oh, I'm a I'm a team sapphire. Hardcore. Kyogre. Um, I would love if I could find it for a good price. Um the uh it's from Primal Clash. I know it's from Primal Clash. The team magma or team aqua's Kyogre. Love that card. I feel like there is a serious lack of ice type Pokemon out here. Holy crap, I ran into a whale. Yeah, the one with the whole team on it. I think it's from Primal Clash. I don't think it's from base. Even though I haven't collected any of those cars or anything like that. I do, of course, go back and look at all the cards that are out there. A trilogy wouldn't be bad. What do we can get here? We fish up like a horsey? I wouldn't mind a horsey. 
Give me a Kingdra? Yeah, that'd be great. Nope, just another freaking whale. <laughs> Run! Mantags are trying to like fly at my face. They suck. Like we are missing a serious lack of ice types. Crap. Heard that Mantike. You just keep your flip. The very last set I collected before finding my collection would technically have been like Gym Heroes, maybe? Because I wasn't, I, I had already moved on to Yu Gi Oh! Oh god, it's Cramorant. Um, I'd already moved on to Yu Gi Oh! and Magic when. Neo Destiny came out. Don't want Cramorant. Give me something cooler than Cramorant. I need an ice type that doesn't suck in this game. Boink. Because that makes sense physically. Fun. One more try, one more try, one more try, one more try. Scram rat, we're done. Alright, we're done over here. In fact, I'm gonna try and kill Scram rat for this. That is how offended I am that he showed up again. She, sorry. The fake gold card, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My nephew gave me one of those and he was so excited. He's He was... In like, uh, hey, e, what's up, buddy? Um, did I fight that person? Oh no, did I? Oh god, quillfish, quillfish. Yeah, he was so excited. He was in like preschool, either either kindergarten or preschool, but he was so excited, and I was like, oh, thanks, buddy. Of course, I had already known. I was like, yeah, that's definitely fake. I didn't even hit you. Why do you get to hit me so hard with revenge? Stupid fish. I think I have Poke Dolls. I'm just being lazy and not using them. Show them. Ooh, what was that? What was that? Pelipper. Hell no. I'm trying not to get smacked in the face by these man tigs. Yeah, my nephew had brought it. And he, like I said, he was just excited. So I was like, oh, thanks, bud. I'll take it. It's still in my personal collection binder. I will say it's at like the last page, though. Okay, we've got to find an ice type that doesn't suck. Also, I hate wearing this bike uniform. It makes me look like an idiot. I don't need help looking like an idiot, okay? Uh, you know what? Ooh. Do I want to go Weavile? Okay, what, what do we want? Do we want Weavile, Frostmoth, or Frostlass? What are we going with? What are we going with? What are we feeling? Only you can choose. That's right. Actually, while I'm here, I'll go heal while you guys discuss. I need to check hockey scores, E. The Penguins have like a very outside freaking chance at this point. Man, everybody I follow on Twitch is going live right now. NHL. 
Mm -hmm. Alright, Flyers have tied it up. Canadians are winning. Kachuk is doing his best job at trying to help his brother by beating the Bruins so Florida can get the first seed overall. But are the Panthers? Panthers are losing to the Leafs, though. Go Weavile? Okay. We'll sneeze all. Yeah. Okay. Weavile it is. Nom. You want me to do? Okay. Okay. Uh, I'm actually... Do I have a coin? I do have a Pokemon coin. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. We'll do... You guys, of course, can't see this. But... I have a Pokemon coin. Oh, is it blind you as it reflects? I used to as a kid. I don't anymore. I gave them all to my nephew. I used to have a lot. I, I have like some Mario Lemieux cards I hold on to and stuff, but that's about it. We'll do the back side is Snom. The front side is Sneasel. All right. Back, back, black is Snom. White is Sneasel. Okay. Flip it. It landed on the ground. It is white side, so it's Weavile. Nox immediately ran over to chew on it. Thanks. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. You did that. I don't want to hear you complain at me. All right, let's get a Sneasel. Oh, how do you trade? How do you? It's a sh it's a Razor Claw. Isn't that how you evolve Weavile? Sounds weird, but I do want a female Weavile. I do not like males. I have whatever you guys want to pick. I get it. I'm just particular about the types of things I pick. Apparently I'm weird because I've never seen Vaporeon as female. I've always seen Vaporeon as male. That's just me. Then some of the younger folks on the Discord introduced me to Copy Pasta and I was horrified. Thank you, Discord, for scarring this old man. Okay, now I can't get a freaking Weavile to pop. Let me pop over here. Make it respawn. Don't ask. Don't worry about it. It's it's something that the kids know about. That is a male snow runt. And Galail, I'm not... Oh, it actually is a female, but... Alright, yeah. You can charge at me, Weavile. Thank you. Or Sneasel for a wee while. Whatever. I can't hit backwards all the freaking time. Uh, shift tree, go. There we go. See if we can just straight up catch it. I have 15 Ultra Balls to chuck at you and 6 Pokemon you have to go through to kill me. Failed. I can probably hit it once. Mmm. Leaf Blade. Don't kill it. Nox box. Buddy, come here. Yeah, I wouldn't Google it, especially on like a family PC. Get in the damn ball, Sneasel. A one shake. Two shake. A three shake pot. Yep. Ba 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 ba. Get wrecked. Captured. Yeah, sit up there, buddy. Hey. Come here. Come here. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's not something I would put on the family PC. Uh, add to party. Evil a physical attacker, so I need to look at that too. Shift tree, get the hell out of my party. You've been nothing but a disappointment since the first gym. That's about all you helped with. Okay. Uh, bag. Do I have a razor claw? Probably not. Oh, no, it's the Grip Claw. <laughs> mm. 
Really? That's fine. Uh, and then I have to evolve her that night, if I remember right, too. Let's say here. Where's the Razor Claw and Sword and Shield? Mm-hmm. You're okay, buddy. Okay, where is it? There will be dot note. It is in... No, I have... Okay, I get that, but where the hell is it? Dusty Bowl? Where the heck is that? The Dusty Bowl. Oh, okay. I see where it is. It's out. Oh, okay, okay. It's all in a quick picture. Okay, so we can go over there. I gotta let Nox box out here anyways. There. Town map. Town map. So it looked like it was like over here somewhere? Oh. I haven't made it that far yet. Okay. Yeah, it kind of looked like it was in this area. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I think it said it was over here. Hmm. Oh, I see some Terra. Or Terra. Of course my brain goes to Terra. That's how many times I've fought Scarlet and Violet so much. Alright, I think it said it was like over here. Like this is considered the dusty area. Oh my god, get away from me! I know, I've done so many Terra fights that when I see the Dynamax stuff, I'm like, oh yeah, it's a Terra fight. It's a large leak, we're not looking for that yet. We're looking for the Claw of Razor Nish. And it did look like it said it was like down over here. And lots of leaks. Oh, I bet it's down there, that looks all like dusty and dead. Let's go check it out. Well, not hitting the Scrafty! Crap! Or scraggy. I can't help it. Like I see the dynamite thing, I'm like, oh yeah, the terrified. I don't think I ever healed Sneasel. That's hilarious. Let's get out of here. Oh god. Ran right into a scraggy again. Good god. <laughs> oh your pants up, Scraggy. You need a belt. Here, little guy. Come here. Seriously. Come sit in my lap. And relax. Come on. Okay. Okay, can I get through here without hitting anything else? All right! What the hell was that? Okay, it was like something just came out of the corner of my eye and scared the hell out of me. And it was a Corviknight, so that, that would... Scare the hell out of me if I saw that in real life. As much as I like Corvids, Ravens, and all that sort of jazz, I don't think I'd want to see one the size of my house. Ooh, what do we got? What do we got here? That's a revive. That's a hit only over there. What the hell is this thing? That's a clay doll, and that's not the right button. Rare Bone. That's a weird name. Rare Bone. Come on. Where is the... Oh, I see a Pokeball over there. What is it? What is it? That's a Sunstone. That's cool, but not what we're looking for. I guess Stardust. Oh god, it'd be horrifying. Like, we think it's all fun and adventures. It's like, these things can kill you. Go take a picture of it. 
Like, this is something that some idiot on TikTok would make popular. Go, go stand next to this giant eagle. Take a selfie with it. By the way, it can carry you away to its nest. Actually, do you sell it? Because you, you, you sell stuff, don't you? <laughs> that was a rip-off lady. You suck. What the hell is this thing? A bunch of thievals in there. Catch them all. Gotta stay the hell away from them all is how I feel. Where is this thing? Right, we caught our Weavile, but... Or our Sneasler, but... Do not have a Razor Claw. <laughs> Look, I'm running in circles. Okay, it shows me all the Pokemon I can catch out here in the Dusty Bowl. Okay, that's what it says, right? The Dusty Bowl is a small desert area in the northern part of the wild areas. Okay, yeah. So this is considered the Dusty Bowl, and they say there's a a razor claw in it. It just says in the Dusty Bowl. It doesn't tell me where in the Dusty Bowl. See you, Gastrodon. Might as well grab this TM. Cross Poison. I feel like poison doesn't get enough love. Like it doesn't have a really cool over the top Pokemon. Pungent root. Maybe Zygarde, but I don't think Zygarde is considered poison. There's that weird jellyfish thing out there. What's this? Another energy root? Pungent root is what that's called. Pungent root. <laughs> Shuckle. Um Pokeball or something over here I missed. I sure as heck I'm not seeing a razor claw. There's a comet shard. First one we got there. Huh. I think the internet is lying to me because I sure as heck don't see a razor claw anywhere here. I know the internet lied. How surprising. Around here, still some dusty areas here. There's also a skunk tank. This is Stormy Wilderness. Dust Bowl. Okay, so when you come back into the Dust Bowl. Okay. We're still in the Dust Bowl. Giant Mirror, Dust Bowl. Still in the Dust Bowl, still in the Dust Bowl. Still in the Dust Bowl. Okay, okay, it goes higher and further than I thought. Okay. We still have a chance to look around here and see if we can find... Oh, God! Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Son of a bitch. <laughs> is that it? No. No. Continue to be disappointed. On the dust wall. Still on the dust wall. Ooh, actually, we're not. Let's go over here. Oh, God! That's a lot of crap. Evasive maneuvers. The ten-year-old on a bike. Um. We are failing at finding this stupid thing. All right, all right, back to the internet. Back to the internet. Oh my god, where is this stupid thing? It says in the Dust Bowl, but you could be a little bit more... Oh, you can get it from freaking Stow on Side Thor. So we just wasted like 15 minutes of stream being stupid. But you know what? All about the friends we made along the way.
I don't know if I made any friends along the way. No, I don't want to trade you. Oh god, get off your bike, you idiot. <laughs> there we go. That person's face is like completely flat. It's terrifying. Alright, do you actually have it? Do you, do you, do you, do you, do you, do you? Doesn't say you do. But again, the internet has light. Hmm. Do you sell stuff? Thanks. I think. Oogie. Okay. Nope. Where the heck? What the heck? It literally says can be. Pro oh, you know what? In shield, it can be bought there. I have to buy it from Hammerlock in my version. That. Oh dear God. Hi everybody, welcome to my stream. This is how very disappointing it can be when watching me. Enjoy. When you feel confused about everything. Yeah. All right, all right, here we go. Like, it's like that statement. It's like, I'm not mad at your stream. I'm just disappointed. And I'm like, yeah, I totally agree. Where the hell is this thing? I know, buddy. Where is it? Do you want to sell something to me? Holy crap. Do you have it? Oh my god. There it is. Wait, I don't have enough BP. What the hell's BP? Uh, Christ. Uh, okay. Oh dear god. I'm watching a quick guy and I feel like I'm being told about this person's life story. Oh good god. We what went right past it. My BP. It's, that is why I take heart medication though, is because I don't produce enough beats per minute, oddly enough. We did go right past it. It's literally... Okay, okay. Can I... Can I... Just point to the freaking map. Yeah, we went right past it. Literally. I'm gonna go into a terror raid and punch something in the face when we're done with this, by the way. I don't care if it's a Pokemon I like. I'm gonna punch it in the face. You make me go down all these stupid hills and get attacked by crap. Let's play. Can we dodge the Scraggy this time? Unpheasant. The oh god, Lanoon at fucking four o'clock. <laughs> it scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Sorry. Got straight up punched in the face. Lanoon out of right field. Made me drop an F-bomb, it scared me. I would say I'm mostly PG-13 on my channel. Mainly. My card videos are definitely rated G. That's why we edit them. <laughs> Oh, 
Good lord. I could, I mean... I've said some things that I've had to buy uh, drinks for somebody after a hockey game. I, I said something so mean. Yeah, when we went over to get the little TM right here, it's right here. I think these are, oh, mushrooms. I thought these might have been apples. Okay, so no. We need to give this sassy little bastard the claw. And I'm going the wrong way. Mm. Okay, and I don't think it's nighttime right now. Or is it? Or is it just thunderstorms? It's hard to freaking tell in this game. Actually, how do you check the time in this game? Oh, I've I've thrown I've been in a fight with somebody and after we both got kicked out of the game, we sat there and shared a drink and watched the rest of the game together. We're grown men and we act like kids sometimes on the ice, but you know. Once you're off the ice, it's over with. This is a four star crustle, and I don't think I have a chance in hell at beating that. Seriously, how do you check what time it is in game? Pokedex, maybe? Sometimes the Pokedex will tell you, like... That's kind of cool, it tells you. Maybe? I feel like there should be a way to tell. No, nothing there. Because when it's... Like, okay, so that looks like daytime right now. Yeah, it's daytime. With a bunch of maractuses around me. That's fun. Because I do have a um, rare candy that'll pop Sneasel into Weavile in one move. Although, while we're out here, let's go ahead and... Oh my god, Dustnor scared me. I hate them popping into existence like that. And you're going full tilt on your 10 speed. Okay, this is a level 4 Flying Steel... Flying steel. Oh, it's a uh, Corviknight. Um, let's try. Uh, let's try while we kill some time. Let's try Cinderance here. Actually, I need to check something here. Hold on. Da -da -da -da. Trying to figure out where you were, buddy. Sitting here, like, looking around the room, and I can't figure out where he is. Okay. Let's see. Corviknight, we are 100% going to hit you in the face with Pyro Ball as much as we can. Super effective against Corviknight. Like I said the other day when we were playing this, though, this would be so much better if you could just skip this cutscene, because... Once you see it, like, a couple times, you're kind of like, okay, I mean, it's cool and all, but this is eating up way too much time every time we see this. I just want to kick this thing in the face with a giant flaming soccer ball. Is so much to ask? I think not. I think it's just the right amount to ask to not have that happen. I use JoJo's outfit? Is that what that is? Oh god, my knee. Ow! Stretch my legs out here. Is that what my outfit looks like? Is JoJo's outfit? I'll be honest, I've never watched JoJo. The animation style in that show never... really piqued my interest. I know a lot of people like it. Kick. 
We only have five uses of this. And I can only Dynamax for three turns, right? Oh, the sucker has a shield. I don't think we're strong enough to beat this one. I mean, he can't really hurt me either. That's good. Maybe I should give Jojo another try. Now, one anime I've never been into, and I know people are going to be like, this is criminal. I never got into One Piece. Nope. Not ever. Good. That broke its shield, at least. But I think I... Oh, lower its defense. We might still beat this one. Even though I'm going to lose my, I think, my Dynamax now, right? Power trip. Who that hit? Oh, wish. That hit. That didn't hit me. No. Okay. You guys are not doing diddly for damn. Oh, mirror armor speed. Sure. There you go. Wah, wow, it. Yeah, I lose my. Dynamax. Why? You can find them everywhere here. I shouldn't say everywhere, but you can find them pretty commonly. There you go. KO'd. Uh, we'll go ahead and catch this, even though we already have a Corvus Squire, because we are going to catch everything in this game eventually. Chuck! The Pokeball. While we wait for this 40 second animation, why don't we check the NHL scores? Man, I'm going to turn off Instagram's push notifications. I get way too many of them. Ooh, Panthers come back leading 4 2. Capitals and Flyers are still tied. Red Wings and Canadians are tied. I think the Red Wings just have to get a point, and the Penguins are knocked out. You know, a large candy for that one. Three of them, actually. That's pretty good. Let's see if it's nighttime when we pop out here. Yeah, the the longest series I think I've ever watched. Uh, so Dragon Ball Z. I'm not like a diehard Dragon Ball Z fan, but Dragon Ball Z was always kind of my thing, and I have enjoyed um the Dragon Ball Super se series. But I'll wait for like the whole thing to come out, and on a day where I'm just kind of feeling like vibing and chilling out, I'll throw it on. Or I'll watch an episode like before bed here and there. Uh, what's the longest series? Like Bleach probably was the longest series I stayed with. And I haven't even watched Thousand Year Blood War. Oh god, yeah. I mean, absolutely. When you're going to blow up the planet Namek in five minutes and it takes 12 episodes. Yeah, of course. God, see, I couldn't do that. I like a good series that... It doesn't have to be long, but it has to be complete. I hate set series that just kind of end on an odd note, and I get it, you know, depends on the source material, where the manga is at, or the, the light novel. My favorite anime, even though it's really gone downhill, but I still like it, is Shield Hero. And don't get me wrong, yes, I agree. It has taken a nosedive after season one. Season three wasn't as bad as season two. Season two is kind of crap. <laughs> to be even polite to it, it's kind of crap. Um, yeah, Bleach, but I only watched Bleach until the fight with Aizen was done. But Bleach has a ton of filler. I mean, the whole... Zanbato or Sword Spirit arc was a huge amount of filler. I don't feel like fighting that again. Holy crap, Sil. It was right behind me. I need to turn to nighttime so we can level our Weavile. And then we'll go kick Raihan's face in. Yeah, Bleach is long. Er, long, somewhat long. 
Shield Hero is good. Um, I do like some of the slice of life kind of high school drama stuff, to be honest. I don't want to say high school drama. I found the anime series called was it 100 Girlfriends That Really, Really Love Me to be hilarious because it's just so ridiculous. I found that series to be funny as hell. Um, My Dress Up Darling was pretty cute, pretty funny. My wife and I liked that one. Uh, Freerin. Freerin was just solid. Like, I, there, there's nothing more to really say about Freerin. Freerin was... I, I didn't watch it, and then people were like, dude, you gotta watch it, you gotta watch it. I was like, okay, fine, I'll, I'll sit down and binge it. Because I didn't even watch it until the second to last episode was released. And I was like, okay, I'll watch it. And, yeah. It deserves every accolade it has received. Yes, Scott. Fully cooly. Very much so. Everybody, that is my oldest brother. But yes, Fooly Cooly is absolutely 100% both anime and soundtrack. An absolute beast. The Gray Man's not bad either, but I haven't even watched the new one. They took like 10 years to make the continuation of The Gray Man. I haven't gone back and watched that. Lord, I need it to turn to nighttime so I can freaking level this stupid Pokemon up. Why did you jump on my YouTube? Did you finally subscribe to my YouTube? Is that why? Because you finally pushed me over 100? <laughs> oh crap, Steelix! Right into a Bronzor. Damn it. I'm glad you're not having the birthday this weekend though, dude, because uh, I wouldn't be there. I know, you guys would be so sad if I didn't show up to his birthday. It's crushed. Well, the funny thing is, I actually on giveaways remove. You already know that, Ricardo. I remove all my family. Any family or like very, very, very like close friends I remove from giveaways. Like, of course, like my wife's not on it. Uh, my two best hockey buddies aren't on it. Oh my god! Turn to nighttime so I can level up Weavile. Yeah, let's say. Uh, what's another good one that I grew up with? I mean, my favorite anime of all time, all time, is Roroni Kenshin. Like, of all time, that is my favorite series. Yes, I have watched the, the remake, and it's been really, really good. Uh, I've watched it in both Japanese and in English, just to get a comparison, like both. And as long as they bring Steve Blum back to do Makoto Shishio in the English version of the next season, mwah, chef's kiss. It'll be wonderful. Oh my god, turn to night. Turn to night. Turn to night. Oh, if they're lower level, do they run? Okay, Diggersby. Stupid looking Pokemon anyway. Is that rain? I don't know because this game confuses me. Hey, look at that. Look at that. What the hell? Move over here. Oh, you gotta be kidding. That's annoying. Okay, we're gonna go stay in this area. Let's see. What other stuff? Trigon. I still haven't watched Trigon, Scott. <laughs> I know you keep telling me to. Although... Oddly enough, one of Scott's favorite animes I do not like. And I couldn't get into it, which was Steins Gate. And I know he loves that anime, and I never could get into it. I could never get into Steins Gate, dude. I don't know why. I did like, um... What was the other one that was really weird that you got me into? Ego Proxy? Not Ego Proxy. What was the one with the egg? Egg something you got me into. Why can't I remember the name of that? With the blue-haired protagonist. It's 
Steins Gate is kind of a mind F of a series. Actually, Ricardo, a series I know you would probably like. Um, that you may have never heard of is Gungrave. That is a sit down and watch together that my brother and I did with that series. Uh, I think it. I think it is two words. Okay, we got to figure out how to turn this into nighttime out here. So I'm just killing time trying to get it to turn to night. Yeah, Gungrave is really, really good. It's kind of a split story, but it's it's worth watching. It was phenomenal. With no, not not to Brandon Heat. Always love that name. Ace Close was always a good one growing up. Big O. I remember jamming out to Big O. There's one that's actually kind of a mine f at the end of the series. That's really good. Of course, Cowboy Bebop. Okay, change to nighttime. More sword, sword and shield. Ward. Okay, when does it ever become nighttime? It's two a.m. here, and it's still daytime in game. Go to the wild area. It's the only place that has true day and night cycle. Then you can evolve your stom. Okay, I get that. It's sneezel, but thank you. But when it's night, date locate. Okay, people are just arguing. The wild area has a day and night cycle from the start. The towns and the root routes have day and night cycles once you beat the main story. Okay. Oh my god. People just started arguing with each other instead of answering the stupid question. The internet, folks. Okay, people are like, you can just do it. Oh, you're fine. Just shoot people in the face. Wait, are you playing a support or are you playing an actual... What are you playing? Are you playing tank support or are you actually a DPS right now? That's what I meant it. That's what I meant it. Hey, you guys get to see my little menu. Yay! The America. Like, I'm... It's late at night here. NVM. Go. Not 4.11 right now. Boom! Nighttime! <laughs> okay. You're playing support. Okay. feel like if I learn the game, I could beat Cole up in it. <laughs> I think it's funny. I just said beat up and that was the move they wanted to learn. All right. Sneasel is going to level up for us. He's evolved into a revile. Holy crap. <laughs> They attack their quarry in packs, prey as large as a mammoth swine, easily fall to the teamwork group of a weavile. Okay. Bling. Again, that's not a bad PvP move, but no, not right now. Alright, we gotta get her caught up here. 45? 47, all the way to 47. She already caught up. There we go. All right, um, let's go punch Raihan in the face. Oops, that's not the right button. Got a popped collar. He knows what he's doing. Pop that collar, walk into the club. Everybody hates him. <laughs> I'm 
Come check out my pop collar. I'm going to punch you in the face is what I'm going to do. Okay, I have to go back to here. Okay. Am I at 100 yet, just out of curiosity? Or am I still sitting at 98? Okay, still too short. Okay. All good, all good. Someday I'll be a big boy and have 100. I'm stunned. I'm not to like pat my own back, but I'm a little stunned that it has taken me that long. I, I mean, to give stuff away for free. <laughs> free stuff. All I gotta do is hit that subscribe button. Alright, let's fight these two idiots. Honestly, though, I bet if I clicked on one, I could fight one on one, but we'll, we'll do the double battle. Need to get a drink here. Pop it open here. Music Cruise, Owen and Andrea. Okay. I do, of course, have Dancer's Full Art card in my personal collection. Oh, we finally found out Toxtricity. Mm -hmm. We have a lot of advantage here. That will definitely kill Weavile if I use it. That should kill Maractus. Mmm, tanky Maractus. Do 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 do. Nom 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 nom. Dude, why why are we doing a stall fight? Okay. Well, we while you might die here. We're gonna do icy wind again, and then I'm gonna do earthquake. Weavile's pretty fast. Flygon's no slouch at speed, and Weavile's outspeeding it. So, all right, Weavile, let's see if you can take an earthquake to the face and live. She lived. I got smacked a little bit and the poison won't kill her. Man, I've been trying to find some Sun and Moon base packs right now. But Sun and Moon is kind of getting out of control right now. Not that, like it hasn't already been, since it's a little bit of an older set, but it's surprisingly getting out of hand. Tomorrow we're doing Arc Nights, by the way. Well, you probably saw my schedule if you saw the community post. It is a new story event that dropped today. And we're going to do it. I don't have a nickname. Sorry, dude. What I want to look at is what has what can I learn here? I honestly think Evo Sky sucks. And the reason I say that is because of the inflation to it. It is way, way overpriced for your ability to get a hit from that. And it is so, so not worth it. I need to go to like a TM shop. Actually, I can buy points. I forgot I can I can buy stuff from the people outside the the cities with those watt. I forgot about that. If they have anything physical, I can teach Weavile here before we go fight.
I mean, have you seen the Morty conviction price? It was 30 day, 30 something dollars for about a week after release of temporal forces. And then it's been artificially pumped. So it's like 131 now. Oh wait, we, we can't fly anywhere. I forgot we have to walk through this stupid thing. As Leon told us to go through the cave. Will you fight me, officer? Okay. Let me through, people. Let me through. Oh, the other Umbreon art thing? Yeah. Shoot, the Umbreon from... U.S. guys, but, uh... Okay, why can't I take a taxi, and why is it telling me to go to this stupid thing? There. Um... Is it in Brilliant Stars? Either in Brilliant Stars or LO, Lost Origin, that has the Umbreon with, um, not, is it Caitlyn? Oh my god, why can't I remember that gym trainer's, or she's an Elite Four member. That has the, um, trainer gallery card. Where's Leon? No. The noise was like some massive explosion. There's a huge surge of red light, and then the wild Pokemon just started Dynamaxing. Reason. Well, even the leafy, uh, or the leafy on, good lord, the um, Mewtwo, the Hollow Mewtwo from One Fifty One, even has a PSA ten, has a pretty like thirty, forty dollar value because it's a Mewtwo. But look at it; it it goes up and down a lot, but it is just a basic Hollow to start. One of the freaking cars we're missing in Temporal Forces, though, is um, the... Um, why does it always make my character look like it's leaning? Hold on. Here. Like, I'm sitting straight, but my camera is making it look like my character is, like, a foliosis in its back or something. Uh, but anyways, I'm missing the... Reverse... Rare mistreat, not mistreatus, uh, Fluttermane from Temporal Forces. Dude, literally, it's making my character like sit like this, even though I'm sitting straight in my chair. I'm sitting straight up. Double Blade. No, it's just a. Uh... It is Double Blade. Sorry, that's a joke for next week's episode that I screwed up saying Double Blade's name. Uh, Icy Wind. Yeah, you really need to be burned to, to beat you. Yep, all that coming. Okay. Uh, where's my Cinderance? Cinderance, please finish it. I don't have time to deal with this reincarnated as a sword anime character over here. Which, by the way, is a real anime name. Reincarnated as a sword. There's also one out, I believe, coming out called Reincarnated as a Vending Machine. I'm done. Pass Simeon? Um, fighting type, I guess. Would be my guess. Uh, let's try Zen Headbutt. Either that or Double Kick. Nope, it's a fighting type. And we got the Flinch Lock. Alright, you're dead. Get flinched. Nothing 
nothing going on on that stream right now. Okay. I'll have to lag on. They're fetched. Astrodon's there. Do do do. Ulti Geist? Uh, no. So, well, yeah, I can still hit it with physical psychic, I think. Uh, the matcha one from Scarlet and Violet has a speed raises. I don't know if it'll be faster than me though. Um, what is it? Sinistra? Yeah, Sinistra has a special art rare coming out and Twilight Masquerade, and it looks cool. If you haven't had a chance, Ricardo, go look at the um, the release info for the ETB of Twilight Masquerade. Um, you'll see the Ogre Pawn art rare that comes with the ETB. It's really good. There you go. Yeah. Should pop up. No, I don't really need to rest. I'm actually okay right now. I actually hate using the bike, I found out. I guess I'll use it. Let me see, we missed something. Berserker, get the hell away from me, you little dwarf looking thing. Can I pop a wheelie on this thing? Why can't I pop a wheelie? You know, Pokemon, if you want to make it more engaging, make it where I can do thick bike tricks. What about that? I'm going to go ahead and heal. I guess I'm forced to see that stupid cutscene with Hop. Alright, let's see if we can beat Raihan with just this team. I have no idea what level Raihan's team is, and I don't care. I know that Duraludon is his ace. Um, I have one of my favorite little art rare cards, which is not an expensive card, is the Duraludon and Raihan where they're like eating lunch together. Really cool card. There it. Okay. Whoa. Let's do a U-turn. What's up, Leon? I'm getting tired of reading this. Add voice acting. You took down that Dynamax Pokemon in no time at all. Well, I am unbeatable champion after all, but that is all going on here. An overflowing red light, Pokemon Dynamaxing without power spots? Yeah, but why? I'm not sure what's going on. That red light could suddenly appear again at any time and we'd have no way of knowing. I know what's going on, so shut up. No, okay. But being able to predict such things is part of a scientist's work. Brain. Magnolia. Chairman called for me. Does Magnolia have a full art? Yeah, she should have a professor's research full art. Oh. I need to find that. That was actually the very last uh, art rare we needed from 151. The last card we actually needed from 151, we had pulled everything. Reverse hollow muck. Nothing worth my time. The chairman's... All wrapped up in fretting over the future of our energy, apparently. He's left everything to the executive lady. We just don't have enough data. No, we have it. I have the master set. Uh, do, you, do you want me to post my master set stuff? Really? Okay, so it won't be next Saturday then? Not this coming Saturday, but the 27th, I mean. Okay. It'll just be me, by the way. There must be. Okay. I mean, I'm, I won't make content out of it, Ricardo. I'll, I'll throw it up in the, the Discord for Scott's Discord. Not you, Scott. Another Scott. Rocket Scott. He's a Pokemon personality. I do have my own Discord, I just don't activate it. My um 
Namazu Discord. There's only, there is only one Scott. There is only Zool. I think you have to be in your 30s or older to get that joke. There is no Karen. There is only Zool. Alright. I honestly didn't read a lick of that because I was talking to you guys and I kind of don't care. Dynamax bad. Chairman's tied up with stuff. Woman in high heels and a stick up her ass is in control right now or something and we have to go fight right hand. Okay. And break. Like, that's all I can think of right now. I mean, I think I summarized it pretty good. I bet if I went back and watched the VOD, I'd be like, hey, I was pretty spot on with that. I don't know if stick up her ass would be NC-17. Just an affectionate way of saying she um, needs a vacation. No, NC seven scene streams would probably involve ball guy in places, and we're not gonna we're not gonna get into that. I need to have ball guy rub Hayami's shoulders. That would be hilarious. I now have a project to work on on some downtime. He'll hate it. <laughs> Rated Y seven. Like I said, I'll get there. Last time on Cutter's YouTube channel, he got his ass handed to him by a really pissed off woman. I hate his jacket. I get what they're going, like the scale and everything. And I don't dislike Raihan as a character. I think he's a cool character, actually. But I hate his jacket. It makes him look like a just complete putz. Do you notice my jersey number, Scott? <laughs> OG67. Gotta fight Sebastian under the sea, under the sea, under the sea, under the sea. Baby, it's better down where it's wetter. Take it from me. Up on the shore, they got. What do they got up there? A lot of sand. We got a hot crustacean bun. I think that's how that lyric goes. Under the sea, under the sea. Now I gotta do team battles, so he's gonna have a support. Okay, Pelipper is always gonna have Drizzle. So it's gonna support either Pelipper or it's gonna support Gumi. 45 pretty good levels though but uh icy wind will beat you uh i can actually dragon claw sligo sligo why go sligo actually how do you pronounce it's mid evolution is it sligo sligo i think is how you pronounce it There we go, 48. Um, no, because we're not... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Nasty's for special attack, isn't it? Yeah, we're not doing this attack with Weavile. No, I was like, it's, it's probably going to either be Tailwind or Whirlwind. That's fine. I'm probably still going to be faster. We'll go with Metal Claw. I know that won't hit as hard, but... Let's see if I'm actually faster. Oh, you... Oh, thank God, it actually missed. Pelipper's an annoying but very good Pokemon and PvP double battles because of its support abilities. 
Mm, actually, how's your crunch attack? Water pulse, that's going to hurt a little bit, but I'm not too worried about it. It'll be a neutral on Flygon. It's not bad, should lower speed. Yep. So now, even if he doesn't die, we have the upper hand on speed. Okay, he's dead. Let's say. I should maybe film doing Scarlet and Violet PvP fights. I'm not great at them, but I do have a lot of fun doing them. See why you managed to make it this far. Sure did. All right, contestant number two. Time to face the second trainer. Come, Camilla. They are. I, I'm, I'm not great at them, but it gives me something to think about. And I like, oh, good. It does give me a little chance to be like, oh, you want to heal? Sure do. I don't have enough potions. I didn't buy any before it came in. Well, we got eight. We're good. We're fine. We're fine. All right, team battle. Team battle. I have the gym trainer full art card too. Nine tails, one of my favorites. Um. We are at a disadvantage with Weavile here. So... Yuri swipes, probably, yeah. We're gonna use Earthquake, Weavile, I'm sorry. Yeah, he's gonna use Shield, yep, Spell Trap. Okay. That was decent damage for three hits. Weavile? Okay, Weavile didn't die yet, I mean. He has a chance to get some XP. Okay, Hatterin got to 49. Shell Trap again. Okay, she definitely died from that one. <laughs> That's okay. Like I said, of course we'll do a... Uh, a... um. Nuzlocke playthrough once we're done beating this for the first time. And I need to map out the Nuzlocke anyways. This will be a fun Nuzlocke. Scarlet and Violet's Nuzlocke was kind of annoying just because of the nature of the game. Made it kind of annoying. I got putting that work in with the crunch dunch. Then the runes. Weather is fickle. Victory and defeat are even more fickle. The weather is definitely fickle. It sucks here. <laughs> we're getting ready for the bike race or the bike ride on Saturday, and we're all we're in a group text, all of us that are going. There are just some very funny conversations currently going on, so. Uh, I'll just use a max revive, I don't care. If we don't get rained out either, high percentage chance are. As long as it's raining, we can ride. If there's lightning, we can't ride. But we've ridden in the rain before. It's not too bad, it just sucks because road bikes have such thin tires that being on that type of surface can be kind of rough to turn and pivot. And I've eaten it on a ride before that I had to retire from because I wrecked so hard. I like busted my legs and my arm and everything. Alright, so... Akamo, probably... Try and finish it off the fastest and then go after her. Obama Snow. Get five, get five, get five. Oh, I never get five. Well, I get five if I use loaded dice. Okamo's down. 
God, I have no idea what to expect from Raihan's team. I, like I said, I know Steraladon. Ooh, I bet he has a Flygon, and I know that from the anime. Yeah, like, I know it's going to hurt Flygon really bad. Be down. Be down. These two will be fine. Fury Swipe. Plus Snow. And... It's not going to take much damage from a Dragon Claw. Maybe a Crunch. See if we can't get a defense down on it. Let's see. Yeah, I was like, we'll still be faster. Obama Snow is slow. Give me more than two hits. Got another four hit and a critical mix, and that's good. Crunch, do it. Drop that defense. I am so dead on Flygon. The goggles, they do nothing. All right, Levi, I'll be fine. Do, 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 Um, I mean, it's overkill, but I guess I can put Thendor in. I do like the fact that Thendorant in some of the anime that I've been able to catch up on here and there is like the Papa Pokemon Wrangler. Like, he gets stuck with all the annoying ones all the time. I do find that pretty funny. And the total bromance between him and Lucario. There you go. 49 for Cinderance. Nice. Nice. Watch the anime a lot of times to try and make sure I'm pronouncing names correctly. Well done. I'm honored to have battled against such a talented track. Nice one. Give me the gym mission. Come on. Time to head to the gym stadium. You've earned the right to face me yourself. Okay, can I can I heal now, please? Bug. Paper potion. Oh yeah, he's dead. Ain't gonna do nothing to him. He dead. What's wrong with you? I tell you, he did. I gonna get up. Uh, we'll start with Weavile and we'll see how it goes. So I would say Flygon and Duraludon are a given. Um, Takamo -oh, oh is probably one, since we just had the other one. And Dragonite maybe ran a little, but we didn't see any. What is wrong with his teeth? Um, damn. What else is next? I'm really. Con I'm not sure. What else would he have? What else would he? Oh, maybe a Gudra. He might have a Gudra. He's got four. Oh, it's a... That's a dragon type? Is Gigalith actually a dragon type? Or is he just there to support Flygon? Yeah, the Dust Storm passive on Flygon is true, so. That Icy Wind would have got him. We would have had it. I don't even see what... I'm not even paying attention. What level is Flygon? Upper 40s here? What do we got? Body Press is going to hurt. Yep. Well, like body Press will hurt. That's fine. Um, let's go with... Yeah, let's go with Gastrodon. Put our big slow girl out there. Got this, she got this. Come 
I don't know the Flygon with the Flygon. That works. Okay, so Flygon and Gigalith. So, I was wrong on that. I don't think he's going to put out Duraludon next. A Stealth Rock, a very annoying PvP move. What do we got? Sanaconda. Very interesting team. Okay. So he only really has two net dragons on his team, really? Paralyzed. Yeah, you jackass. Our girl's putting in work, man. She might be slow, but she is mighty. I will say the music, though, in Scarlet and Violet is considerably better than um, Sword and Shield. Not that there aren't some really good banger songs here in Sword and Shield, but not as good. I need to actually... I want to do this. I think I have one, right? I really not have one. Son of a gun. I have a full heal. I don't have a full restore. All right, fight Dynamax. Max Wormwind. Okay. All right. Okay, the little like chibi the little icon of Duraludon's adorable. <laughs> now I have to kill it. Now it has to die. Takes a stealthy. That's pretty sick. I like that. That was good. Fight this building. I like Duraludon not in its Gigamax form, though. I think its Gigamax form looks pretty stupid. I like our Chaladon a lot, too. I use that in a lot of Terror Raids, and actually is a great PvP Pokemon. Flygon looks B-A that big. Okay. Well, that hurt like hell. At least I was able to hit it back. Oh. Oh. That is not good. Because I am... S well, I can actually heal. Haha. Uh -huh. Because I have two Pokemon on the field. Uh Hmm. Yeah. I'll try it. I still have the sandstorm up, so so we can dodge something would help actually. Nope. Might die here. Still held on. Problem is I can't remove the stupid paralyze. See how Max Quake does. Oh, Max Quake with the big hit. There you go, homeboy. And my Spadef goes up. Nice. Uh, my the sandstorm drop though. Damn. Uh, let's go for another heal. I have a Max Potion. We get another pass paralyzed here. We do, we get the kill. Hmm. 
Good. That's the def is kicking in actually to help. Okay, that's fine. Huh. We actually ran out of <laughs> We ran out of our abilities. Now we're just little again. I wonder if I'm faster now. Yeah, I was like, I bet I'm faster now. Yep, there we go. We'll take that win. A little bit of a cheesy win, but we'll take it. So 48 is the max we could hit for the last gym. Okay, that's good to know. Look how happy Gastrodon is. I might have lost, but I still look good. Maybe I should snap a quick selfie. <laughs> what can I possibly say? Calling myself Leon's rival? Seems I've grown quite con conceited for someone who can't even claim the title of champion. I'm confident in both myself and my team. I'll give you what you want then, the proof of your victory, the Dragon Man. Thanks you six foot eight monster. Can now catch anything. Collected all the gem badges from the Gala region. Now win your way through the semifinals and and finals. For your chance to challenge Leon. You must. You owe us that much at least for beating us in this battle here today. Sure, I guess. Whatever. Are they automatically in? And the penguin season, I think, has come to an end. Let's find out. Yep. Penguins, doesn't matter. It's over. Detroit won and... Uh, actually, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. If Detroit won... Oh, they had the tiebreaker. They had the tiebreaker. That's hilarious. Penguins will miss the playoffs, so it doesn't matter. Cool. Go Stars. <laughs> Sorry to hold you up, but there was something I forgot. First off, as a sign of my respect, here's TM99. It contains the move Breaking Swipe. That's that AoE move. Is it a Dragon-type move, though? Oh, okay. Yeah, nice. Look at here's the dragon type gym uniform. Oh, thanks. Cool. Yay. Woohoo. Can't say I care. Good on you, kid. Now prove your strength to the whole region. The Champions Cup. There you are, Leon's little brother. Don't worry, I'll give you a battle that'll make you want to quit the gym challenge altogether. Right out lots of different strategies, and I've made up my mind about how I want to battle. Not gonna lose. Oops. Okay. I'll be seeing you. Let's have another epic battle. If you're ever feeling up to it, you might want to go train hard in the wild area. Okay. Is that basically telling me I should go train in the wild area? I feel like it's telling me like a little, you know, hint, hint, nudge, nudge kind of thing. Hey there. Gave Raihan a good thrashy, and that means you've completed the gym challenge. Congratulations from the bottom of my heart. I really wish you... Excuse me. I really wish we could celebrate, but I think there's something we should talk over. Just stop and get a drink. Almost destroyed the whole gallery. Oh no. Who would have thunk it? Where the hell is my mouse? There we go. One to us. But we still don't know how fully controlled the energy behind Dynamaxing or how the two heroes managed to do so. 
back, we're not even really sure who or what the two heroes actually were. A legendary sword and shield. Telling you, my dearest, my lab coat is yours. Oh, she graduated. <laughs> you sure, Grant? I still haven't finished the work you've assigned me. I think this is something to help you finish that work. That's funny. Yeah. The two heroes that protected the Galar region from the darkest day. And the legend of Sword and Shield you just mentioned. It's up to you to figure out the truth behind it all. I know, Gran. I'll do what I can. You and Hop could be the one to take down Leon, and I don't want to miss that. Not to worry, you can count on me to take care of everything. You just focus on getting to Winden. Winden. Go on, head to the station, and you'll miss your train. Okay. I go now. I'm tired of generic standing. Holy crap, I had some. Which game delay there? What the hell was that? Here we go. Uh, oh, yeah, there's a train station this way, right? Yeah. Swear to God, if it makes me fight Hop or some crap, I'm going to be so pissed. Just let me go to the. None of it. Mm. Wait up, I'm coming! I had Ryham beat in no time. Once I got my head on straight and stopped doubting every decision I made, that is. <laughs> I don't like Hop. Don't like him as a rival at all. You're pretty different from the champion. But your strength is genuine, as proven by the dragon badge you have won from me. Ooh, crack that neck. Holy crap, I just cracked my neck. Uh, hold on while I reboot. Oh my god. Uh, okay. By the way, through the Champion Cup tournament, face Leon, once you do. I reckon I'm still in my favor to win, but I'm up to against my true rival. Hop, I will crush you. I will crush you and send you back home. Stop talking. Hop, you talk too damn much. I mean, I'm OG, like, you know, I'm... Gary Oak, to me, is still the best rival. Especially because of the, his development through things like the uh, the anime and the cartoon. But I really like Nimona. I thought Nimona, she didn't talk too much. She was pretty cool. Hey, in-game, what's going on? Let me I didn't see that right away. Although my chat is on delay, so I can always make sure I see it. He's on the floor currently. I think. I think he's actually... Hold on. You'll see my model probably freak out here. Yep. He's asleep on my work bag right behind me, which is behind my chair. Not bad. Not bad. We're getting close to... 100 followers on... Oh, I sat down. 100 followers on YouTube. I'm two away on there. And we're 0.8... 0.8 away viewership wise on Twitch to get affiliation. So we're getting really close. So it's been pretty good. I'm only streaming three times this week because I've got a, a thing to do this weekend with some people. So just today doing Pokemon. Tomorrow we're doing Arknight's new stuff, which can't wait to get my butt handed to me in chapter 13. This is like the first chapter we've had in forever. Pokemon. Oh god, why did I run into that? Oh, there's a Cub Chew over there too. And then on ba -ba 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 -ba, Thursday, 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 before I leave town, uh, we'll be doing the next part of True's Annoyer and o Unicorn Overlord, which has been really fun and really a pain in the ass to play. Really good at the, sh the long maps, the short maps, I am God awful at. Oh, all good, yeah. I think Ricardo's still there. My brother might even still be there. But there are people there. 
I do like the fact though that my chat is working. I can see now that both Twitch and YouTube's chat are working properly. It took forever for me to fix that. Girdivore. Um, I don't really have a good counter for Gardevoir. I mean, Metal Claw will hurt it, but it's not going to hurt it much. Actually, it hurt it a hell of a lot more than I thought it was going to. That will hurt. Yep, it's a split hit. That's fine. She'll get buffered by the hail. I won't, and she'll die to the next Metal Claw here. This should get her... Oh, you gotta be... Mm. Oh, she went with Calm Mind. Cool, she'll die to hail. Thank you. Don't get me wrong, I support Calm Mind. I do. But I also support you dying to weather effects. Our girl got the level 50. Good job, Gastrodon. Good job, good job. Oh crap, I only have three potions left. Eh, it's fine, it's whatever. I can always fly back and just walk through here. I sneak past this person. Sure can. Oh god, it's Galarian, Mr. Mime. No. We'll just go ahead and stick away from that nightmare. You're a hiker. Are you going to be using a rock type? Dude, your face freaks me out. Field type. Mm, okay. The only problem with Icy Wind is it's a sp attack. It's not a physical. That kind of sucks for my damage. Um, I guess that's fine. Yeah, because we're using sp attack, so... Well, damn. <laughs> That's all I have to say about that hit. Oh, damn. I need to sneeze and I have to mute my mic. Oh, God. Ah, this is what happens when I work in the yard. Like, I was working in the yard before stream today. I got home. Started grilling. Got into the yard. Uh, to put down weed and feed and stuff. Oh, you're going to burrow? Okay, I'm going to go up in the air. Boink. Later. I like how I still get hit by the hail in the air, too. Get bounced on, homie. I'm going to use dig again. because I'll go Oh, I landed the paralyzed with bounce. Unbelievable. Unfreaking believable. I'm shocked. Uh, let's try Pyro Ball again. Pyro Ball has like a 95% accuracy, I think, and I miss it constantly. Steelix just got his head blown off. Okay, this hail thing is stupidly annoying. Uh, Muzzeal? Yeah, we'll put a Gastry. Go on, Gastrodon. Low and steady, girl. Beats the horse. I still love this angle. Because it makes Gastrodon look so huge, and Gastrodon is a tiny, 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 tiny Pokemon. 
Oh my god, I'm faster. Holy crap. <laughs> I realize I have the level advantage, but for my Gastrodon to be faster than anything, that's impressive. All right, Douglas. I do not like his face. It creeps me out. It's just weird. It really is. We've all good up. What's the energy power? 60? Sure. That'll get you close to full health. There you go. I keep trying to like spin my camera, but I forgot these are fixed angles for the Oh my god, that's a bomb of snow. Bye. Bomb of snow. You can just... No, no! Oh god, it touched me. It touched me. I feel dirty. I wish to run. Actually, we're not even going to mess around with you. I'm going to give it a doll to play with. Because I want to get the hell away from this thing. Where the hell are my Poké Dolls at? Oh my god, do I really not have any? You know, we freaking kidding me. I thought for oh yeah, there it is. I was like, what the hell? Here's it all. Later. Yoink. Here, I mean I'm gonna fight everything in here because we need the XP anyways. Why does everybody's face flat? Well, this is annoying. Push her back. I figured. We're both going to use Metal Claw. Or you, I guess, can just die. Cool. Thank you. Thank you for sucking and dying. That was beautiful. That was very helpful to the cause. Do you have anybody else here saying, I don't even keep looking at, do they have more than one? Blade Hall? Um, who do I want to, hmm. Hmm. Clay Hall, Clay Hall, Clay Hall, Clay Hall, Clay Hall. It's a psychic type, isn't it? Yeah, so we'll put, we'll just do neutral to neutral here. Hold on. What is it, buddy? Where are you at, bud? I hear you talking to me. Where are you? You wake up? Okay. You want to get up here in your spot? Hold on. Cat, cat interruption. Cat interruption. Come here, Bobo. Here, buddy. Ugh. There you go, buddy. There you go. Yeah. Do you want to chill out for a bit, bud? You woke up. We still got about, oh, about 40 minutes till we go to bed, bud. No, he wants to get down here in my lap. Okay, uh, what? anyways, um, Dazzling Gleam. Okay. Go up here in my lap, buddy. Hey, come on. We're both going to get hit by the hail. Hey, buddy. What? Come on, big guy. You can get up here. Mr. Knoxbox. Come here, big guy. Alright, Ronald. Battleman? That's the dumbest writing I've ever seen. Alright. Will you come up here and just chill, buddy? 
Do you actually sit? Yeah. There, yeah. You want to make biscuits? Go for it. Make biscuits. Knock yourself out. Alright, I currently have a 12-pound cat sitting on me making biscuits. This is my life now. Keep Weavile on the front, because at least I don't have to worry about the buffed by hail the worm crap each time. It's sellable postman. What will postman use? Maybe a Bolton? Harper. What do you got? Pelipper. Oh, okay, that kind of makes sense. Here comes Drizzle. Weather changes. Like, I really don't want to fight Pelipper. Pelipper is actually a really annoying Pokemon. It's fairly tanky if you're not so, really fury. You're only going to be in the end of Tailwinded. Uh, I don't really have a counter for Pelipper. I'm freezing with icy wind. Oh no, I still should use a physical attack. What am I, the hell am I doing? This is a little interesting. If I do a, you know, Nuzlocke, I can go to level 48, which means I can go to the level of the gym trainer that you're going to fight. But these trainers are lower levels, so do we go by the gym level then? Really? Roost? Okay, I'm switching something to try and kill this one hit, or this is going to take forever. I don't think I have anything super effective. I'll put Hattern out. Probably has a chance of landing a critical with like Psycho Cut or something. Yeah, so do we go by the gym level then? It has to be a Nuzlocke so I can use the hashtag. That's why. Alright, Tailwind petered out. Not like it wouldn't have been faster than me anyways. Actually, I'm going to have to look at the rules on that because of the fact that I'm higher level. I will be higher level if I go by the gym leader's level. Because Duraludon was 48, but these people are only 46. But I do think it is only done by the, um, the level of required fights. Like, I don't have to fight this person in a Nuzlocke. I think it goes based off of what the required fights are. You gonna roost again? Okay, at least we killed this thing. There, are you good now? Yeah, hi big guy. He's curled up in a ball now on me. Hi big guy. You can go back to sleep, I'll hold you. Somehow we missed a Psycho Cut, which means he's going to roost again. This is a load of crap, and this fight is taking way too damn long. He might actually kill me because of the fact that he used... He's going to kill me. Okay, I'm faster. That was annoying. That's why I hate Pelipper. Pelipper is so damn annoying. Red. Yeah. All right. What do we got? Knocked out. Let's switch to... Oh, got it. Didn't hit switch because I'm brain dead. Um, I don't know. Dazzling Gleam, you're going to kill Hatter. Anyways, you're faster. Yep. Hold that stupid move. All right, big guy. You're okay. Yeah, you're okay, big guy. So fetched. Very smooth brain, like koala level smooth. Nobody gets that joke. Koalas are literally the dumbest animal on the planet, so. Oh, it laughed. It would have died to the hail there. Frick. I 
you doing, big guy? You sleepy again? I got gotcha. you. I don't know why you're so anxious lately, buddy. Hmm? I do need to trim your nails, though. You're clicky clacking when you're walking over the floors in the house because your nails are so long. Did it only knock out the one? Yeah, it only knocked out Hatturn because I just didn't care. It is nice to be able to play kind of just completely casually. Nuzlocke's feel tense all the time. The koala, little fact here, eats eucalyptus, okay? If you put a koala in a room full of eucalyptus, but they're not on branches, it will starve to death. Because the koala is too stupid to eat the eucalyptus on the ground. You can only eat the eucalyptus if it's on a branch. It could be surrounded by it and it will die. No, they just, they don't understand the concept of not eating it off a branch is the problem. Like, they don't get it. I was hoping I could get at least five hits there for some decent damage before we went down. Koalas are horrifyingly scary with the noises they make. They're full of chlamydia. They're just terrible creatures, actually. The Norant. They are. They're like 98% of all koalas have chlamydia. It's just weird. They're aggressive, they're loud, they're gross. And everybody's like, oh, koalas are so cute. I'm like, no, they're not. They're, they're not cute at all. Uh, Flygon, go for it. I'm being so lazy with this, man. Flygon. My goggles will protect me from the hail. Who's faster? You or me? I'm going to say me, and we're going to go with the Dragon Claw. Ooh, one hit KO. Do I still get hit by the hail? Okay, good. Actually, I don't know much about the old Corviknight legend. Oh, Godfrey. I don't either, so shut up. Nope, 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 absolutely not, absolutely not, absolutely not, absolutely not. Stop trying to Naruto run after me, you stupid thing. Air tick. Here, we'll take a nice little stay. The gateway koala. Hey, Galarian Rapidash. Hi, buddy. Nope, we're done. There's a serial killer at this camp. Freaking Galarian, Mr. Mime. Uh, hyper potion. Give it to fetch. To fetch. Now we use a max revive. Get Weavile back up. All right, we're good. I don't want to be at this camp with that psycho, Mr. Rhyme. Dick. Oh, what's up? Flat faced NPC. Freaking Gigalith. Uh
Well, we know there's a, another special set, which is the dragon one. You might see some stuff in that. Possibly. I would definitely say myth overall, though. Um, There's no real reason to go back to Gen 2 stuff right now. You still have a lot of the Paradox stuff you can push with uh, Scarlet and Violet make sets of. Also, you got to think, you're getting a new set about every... Um, let's see, every two and a half to three months you're getting a, a new main set. And by this time next year, we'll probably be into the new Mega Evolution stuff would be my guess uh, for the new game being released. Let's see if I'm faster than a Gigalith. <laughs> I am. Need to get the info on that uh dragon set. Typhlosion is not my starter from that for alligator was. I love for alligator. Although I get really mad at for alligator in an upcoming video. <laughs> like really mad at for alligator. I had to edit out some stuff. I don't mind Chikorita though. Like, uh, I w you could do a really, really, really pretty SIR with Chikorita. Or, um, Magani. Oh. That's tough. Um. Ooh, that's tough. And the reason being is my favorite Pokemon type is Ghost. Uh, it has been since I was a little kid. Uh, I know it sounds super basic, but since I'm an OG player, Ghost can be my favorite. Because I was around when the game first came out. I didn't jump on the Ghost train. Because people are like, oh, Hunter and Gengar, yeah, they're so edgy, emo. No, 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 no. I'm an OG Ghost user. So... Um... I'd probably go Skeledurge. Although, Skeledurge is my only fire starter ever. I am not a fire Pokemon user, really. Um, up until Skeledurge, my favorite fire type was a ghost type, and that was um, Chandelure. I'm not the biggest fire type fan. My first starter was Squirtle. Let's see, what starters did I use? Squirtle, Alligator, Piplup, Brokey. I'm usually a water user. True and true, yeah. I'm us I'm usually a water user. I'm really getting tired of fighting ice type versus ice type here. Especially this dumbass looking Dar Darmanitan thing. Suck it. That headbutt would hurt with that giant chrome dome thing. Uh, I went with Decidueye. Decidueye was also my starter. Oh, I should have changed. That's steel type. What the hell am I doing? Yep, I was looking wrecked. A chance in hell. Phalanx needs an evolution. Call it Legion or um, Praetorian. 
Oh yeah, call a Praetorian. That would be kind of nice. Um, it's just burn it. <laughs> yeah, but see, I didn't know Hisuian Typhlosion was Ghost type. I just knew this. I like Cyndaquil. I love Cyndaquil. But yeah, even in Arceus, my starter was Decidui. My only fire, yeah, really, my only fire starter ever has been Skeleturge. And I don't regret that. Skeleturge is B A. Um. I think honestly think Clock of All kind of sucks. I know I know a lot of people like like I like Quaxley. I like I like the starter. I even like the mid evolution, but I think Clock of All sucks. Meowscarada is awesome. I really like Meowscarada. I like Meowstick. I like Sprigatito. Actually, I have the shiny plates framed up on the wall behind me here. I'm going to get hit here. I'm just kind of hoping I can live through a single hit. I How the hell am I faster than you? Okay. Like from those uh, shiny premium collection sets that came with like the little frame things. They're fetched. Slam? Slam might not be bad to learn. Nope. That accuracy is ass. No, I never even did Paldane Fates. We we agreed, my my partner and I, we both agreed that do the cards. We were like, yeah, we're not doing Paldane Fates. Too big of a set, too hit or miss, too and, and the issue of batching is a real issue. I'm sorry, I'm not some conspiracy theorist. It is a huge issue. So if you're getting all your product in the same area, your likelihood of completing that set or getting at least enough hits to start a completion of a set that size, needing that many rare hits and needing the baby shine, you're not going to do it. You're not going to be able to hit it. Yes. So I've pulled, like I said, I've pulled the Alakazam the most, followed by the Charizard and Zapdos. I've pulled two Venusaurs, and I've pulled one Blastoise. And funny enough, the Blastoise was from the very first pack ever of 151 is where I got our SIR Blastoise. That's the only one we have. Um, Earthquake's going to miss King, King Clang, I think. Oh, he doesn't have Levitate. Okay. I was like, that's going to be a KO. Uh, Giovanni's Char Charisma, or whatever it is. It's Giovanni's Charisma, right? Yeah. Pulled that one a bunch. I pulled Erica's Invitation twice. Uh, One for the Master Set, and one's actually at PSA right now. Uproar is not a bad move. It can do a decent amount of damage. Hmm. It's a special attack 90. What is Dragon Breath? Yeah, we'll swap out. Actually, I just sold an Alakazam the other day. 151's been a goofy set. Not like in a bad way or anything. It's just been um extremely up and down. Do I have another flying type so I don't get killed? No, screw it. Uh, Sir Fetch, get in there. Yeah, the Alakazam, I think I've pulled. Good lord. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
two, maybe five or six of. Hold three of the Charizards, three of the Zapdos, two Venusaurs. I honestly can't tell you how many freaking Giovanni's Christmas I've pulled. It's like every other SIR or every SIR it feels like is that that Giovanni. No, it's a bad thing. It's a good. It's a it's a really kick ass card. But when you see it with all the other options available in that set, it just kind of suck. That's actually gonna hurt. And I was like, her game would probably kill me. Yep. Of course, she doesn't have to worry about like seventy five percent accuracy. Now she'll never miss. I think Giovanni is still to this day the best well-rounded bad guy. Like Maxi and Archie, they're cartoonishly stupid, which is kind of the charm of like um Saf or uh, Ruby and Sapphire. Um Why can't I remember whose ends adopted dad? He was a pretty bad dude. Like a, he, he was a good bad guy. Well, let's try my nuts. Who the hell is his name? Xerneas? Is that his name? Lysander is a psycho. Like. Lysander's issue is he's just out of his damn mind. And Cyrus, Cyrus is kind of, Cyrus is kind of whatever. Cyrus seemed like he was just, how do I put it? How do I, how do I describe Cyrus? Somebody who thought he was philosophical, but really just dumb as hell. That's who I think Cyrus is. I don't even really consider Volo a bad guy. No, spoiler alert. Arceus has been out for a couple years, so I don't care. But Volo just being like, ha ha, I'm the bad guy. There was always something off about Volo in the game. So you always felt like there was something that was going to happen. I mean, I don't consider Volo like a bad guy. I guess Lysander. Or, yeah, I guess Cyrus could be a prophet. He thinks himself a prophet. Would be a good word more than a philosopher. And he's just not. That's it. Thank you. Thank you. I couldn't think of the ends like adopted dad or whatever his name. Thank you. I couldn't think of his name. He has a really cool secret art rare in Paldea Evolved for boss's orders. That was driving me nuts. I could not think of his name. Like I could see his face because his, his his character design is so um, recognizable. For the life of me, could not think of his stupid name. It's like the first time we've really spent money in this game. I wonder how much do I have to sell you? Uh, you want some cool items, Eagle? All right, we started like over 400k. Let's see if we can get back to 400k. Who the hell were the... Oh, wasn't Team Rocket the bad guy in Gen 2? I barely remember Gen 2. I sounds bad. 
There's a lot of Pokemon I like from Gen 2. But wasn't it like Giovanni like tried to come back in Gen 2? I'll be honest, I completely ignored Hop. I don't know what the hell he said. I didn't really care. Is there a clothing store here? Oh my god. Will I finally get my glasses at the end of the game where I can see? Let's see. Sports glasses, sports glasses, sports glasses. Oh my god. I'm still blind. I'm running around this game blind as ass. How about new pants? What's the track suits? Holy crap, those are ugly as hell. Let's buy some. I wish they had. God, that looks terrible. How about bags? You got a cooler bag? Oh, you literally have a suitcase. Like, that would be tiresome to run across a country wearing that damn thing. Dudes, what you got? What you got? What you got? Oh, God, those are terrible. Those are those are all bad. If you were a European and you played this game, would you be offended by the fashion choices they made for this game? I feel like you would be. Just saying. I'm still blind, technically. I don't have my glasses in this game. I've just been throwing Pokeballs and hoping they hit something. We've gotten lucky. It's like a fun house over here. Like I said, I completely ignored what the hell Hop was saying. Ooh, there's a Pokeball, though. Air Balloon, we know what that is. <laughs> Dude, that, like, would you want to carry that, like, Carry on luggage on your back and run across all of Europe? No. They did not think of how to properly do bags for the protagonist in this game. I would have taken a fanny pack and looking like an idiot more than the things that they give you to wear on your back in this game. It's just giving me money. There's something there. I missed it. Right? Nope. Just just a line of chalk. All right. Now there is something. Dude, it's so bad. Like, like I said, I don't even have my glasses yet. I can't see anything. What the piss game? Up here then? Okay, apparently the bike can't go around that. This better be worth my time. Not even remotely. My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined by that. Oh my god, I hate the bike. I really do hate the bike in this game. Good lord, I just went back to the same... Much obli- Dude, I just ran you over with a bike and probably hit you in the junk. I don't think you feel much obliged about that. You missing anything? Oh, yep. I don't have my glasses, I can't see if I'm missing anything.
No Dementors in the game. I didn't see that. I saw somebody, so, you know, I'm a, I'm a Harry Potter fan. I'm not like, oh god, yes, Potter. And I'm a Slytherin. I saw somebody the other day with a Death Eaters um, sticker on their car. I was like, I mean, I get it if you want to cheer your house on and stuff, but those people are like murdering terrorists. Yeah. I'm not sure I'd support that one. I don't think I can get behind that one. You know, I love train rails that can cause rather amusing trouble sometimes. Okay. This person is sitting very conspicuous. Nope, just generic NPC. Alright, mm-hmm. Oh, when we get done, we gotta get the DLC to go play, too. Okay, I guess... Gotta go up this way, it said? Yeah. Guardian Leviosa. Punch you in the teeth, Hermione. And see if you can say it with a lisp. Are you selling stuff, sir? Are any of you selling stuff? Oh my god. Okay. Big building! Yay! I have no idea what level this stuff's gonna be, and I have a totally half-assed team. But, I don't care. I don't know why, because it's a kid's game, and as long as you're overpowered and have enough potions, you don't lose. That's why doing a Nuzlocke actually makes it challenging. Hey, the gym challenge. The semifinals begins. Please head to the stadium pitch when you are ready. Uh, yeah. Okay. Da, 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 da. What time is it? Crap. Will be doing this? Oh god. Okay, let's just trigger this and then call it a night because it's nine fifty. I don't want to get into like a battle gauntlet. And we won't be back at this though until next Tuesday. But. If we can clear it next Tuesday, we can then pick up the DLC stuff and start that. Oh, I get to fight Marnie first? Okay, so we're going against the dark team? Okay. I'm gonna kick your butt. Honestly, Thomas, this is this is how I would imagine Ayami talking trash as a Pokemon trainer. <laughs> I do like Marnie's theme, though. But it's got nothing on, like, the Team Star fight and stuff like that. Like, those are just too good. I don't get why people are like, oh, Marnie's this sad person. Like, Marnie always looks... normal. Lightboard's... Yeah, I was like, Lightpart's probably faster, and she has a specially intact Lightpart, okay. Yeah, I like Marnie's theme. Just shy, okay. I have a couple Marnie cards. The one I actually don't have is the Milk Carton promo, so maybe it would be worth that? I don't know. Oh, I'm going to get hit in the face, like, really hard after Nasty Plot goes off. Let's see, what will it use with Nasty Plot? Double Nasty Plot. Triple Nasty Plot. Well, Weavile's dead. I mean, not... <laughs> She's maxed out her Spatak, but I'm trying to think of what Lipard... What Spatak is normal type for Lipard? Well, actually, we'll never know, because it's dead. Oh, 
Crafty. Oh, it's dark. What the hell am I doing? I always think Scrafty is a fighting type in my brain. Like, her theme sounds like something that would be in Mega Man. That'll hurt. Well, it's going to confuse me. The problem is it just raises my attack, not my spatak, so... Kill it. Now we can switch out. Morpeko next? No, I imagine she's going to Dynamax. Dynamax. Morpeko. Toxic Croak. Imagine it's gonna start with Sucker Punch. Actually, Sir Fetch would have been better here because I could have Iron Defensed. It's okay. But see, again, I'm running into the issue. Like, Raihan's ace was 48, Marnie's only 47. So doing the Sucker Punch. I actually didn't start with Sucker Punch, I'll be damned. I'll have to read the, the rules that people have set in place for the Nuzlocke for. Golden Shield. We more Peko or more Pico, depending on how you want to pronounce it. Um, you know, I had fun Dynamaxing Flygong. He looks so cool as a Dynamax. Oh no, she's not going to Dynamax. More Peko. Like, the graphic engine for the fights in this game are considerably better than that of Scarlet and Violet's. Like, graphically, it looks a lot smoother and a lot cleaner in this game. I don't even see who she's putting out, so we're just going to leave Flygon out. And she's backing me up. I'm really, really going to win. Oh, Grimmsnarl. Okay, that makes sense. Because that is a... Big Dynamax one. We'll go with... Yeah, we'll go Max Quake again. <laughs> Get like on. Impidimp and that whole line with Grim Snarl, and I'm not a big fan of it. Not only it looks bad, it is interesting to have a dark fairy type. Kind of looks like a djinn. Oh god, it's a giant heartless. Yes? No. You're going to hit me with max darkness now. I get my spadef up and you're a special attacker at max starfall. Okay. Well, shit. <laughs> That's about all I can say about it, though. All right. It's all right. We'll still win. I'm not worried. Even without a Dynamax and... She already used her full restore. I don't know. What do we throw? Uh, Gastrodon. Low and steady, girl. <laughs> Look how tiny she is compared to it. <laughs> She's so slow, too. Can you take the max starfall? Look at her take that hit. Only got one more hit, Gar Grim Snurl.
Oh, our train, my favorite move, just like. Okay, you gonna do Max Starfall again? That was an interesting move. That was straight up a heartless move. Oh no, Gastro. Uh, I don't care. I mean, we're gonna win. We just gotta keep. It can only. It, it's gonna go back to small size anyway, so we'll send in the fetched. Far fetched, so fetched. Back to normals. A little weirdo. You did. Technically, I could get to level 49 with Pokemon before fighting Marnie, because her ace is 49. Okay. Okay. Surfetched. Victorious Surfetched. Okay, so I lost, but I get to see a lot of good points. Thanks, Marnie. I have to see which... I think I have two Marnie's cards. I think Marnie's Pride. And then I have another one. Marnie's Dream? That's so bad. Way to go, Marnie. Like, if we got Penny's theme up in here... Oh, that, that, that theme slaps. Oh my god, Hop, please shut the hell up. Pardon me. I know you didn't get a long break, but the match before yours ended more quickly than expected. Elder Hop won quite handily. As soon as you're ready, we'd like you back on the pitch. That's great. No. Uh huh. Hey there. I'm gonna chat with your mate, the ball guy. Okay, I mean, thanks, but God, please get, like, at least 30 feet away from me. Uh, how's my team, actually? Oh, you get a full heal in between five. Okay, well, whatever. Alright, 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 alright. Let's, uh... Save your progress. Actually, how long have we played? How long have we played? Only 20 hours? We only got 50 Pokemon, dude. That's okay. Alright, alright, alright. With Vault being in, that will take us to the end of... See you, Thomas! To the end of the stream for today. I'll be back tomorrow with the next Arknight event. Uh, chapter 13 and everything, so we'll see how that goes. And then we'll get set up for our Unicorn Overlord next playthrough on Thursday and then I'll post some stuff up on the community for YouTube when I'm out and about uh, at the lake this weekend for the bike ride and everything and uh, don't forget when we hit 100 subscribers I'm going to be giving away that Pokemon or that Pikachu V10 and don't forget to like comment and subscribe on the YouTube as well for your chance to win the Iono collection box you have to like comment and be a subscriber on any video in April and on Twitch you guys want to tune into Twitch, that would help me. I'm really close to getting my um, my affiliation on Twitch. I'm like 0.8 or 0.7 away viewership-wise to get my affiliation, which would be really cool. Although, like, I don't have constant engagement on Twitch because I'm so small. And I think affiliation helps with the algorithm there. And um, I'd make like a dollar a month. But everything's going back into this channel. More cards, more giveaways, stuff like that. So... We're very close to getting there. But guys, can't do without you. Appreciate you. Love doing it. Love doing this at night. Um, I'm going to go take some meds. My throat's actually still really sore. 
and working out in the yard with the allergies has been uh, killing me. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Stay safe. Later.